Chainlink FX9598 is currently in the news because it first for the first time broke the 5 GHz uh, clock frequency range. The processor has an 8 core and to be frank it has not the 5 GHz normal clock frequency. The normal clock frequency is actually 4.7 GHz. But um, the turbo clock is 5 GHz, which essentially means that the processor is normally work at 4.7 GHz, but when it's required, it can increase its clock frequency to 5 GHz. But anyway, the clock frequency is not the only thing about the processor. There are other factors that govern the processor performance. But uh, nonetheless, uh, with another constraint, with the higher clock frequency, it usually results in more performance. The most concerning fact is higher CDP rating for 220 watt, which makes this processor uh, a little bit too hot, and that's why one reason why AMD is only allowing system builders uh, to use this processor. Otherwise, a common person uh, can can make this something go wrong with the heat and then burn this processor. The processor is released in, uh, in June 2013 and its expense is close to $1000 and maybe its uh, sibling uh, FX9370 is a better one. In June 2013, AMD released two processors, the FX9370 and FX9590. The FX9370 is more affordable. Uh, it's got 300 MHz uh, less than 